country road take me home to the place i belong welcome back to another truck and vlog guys okay bro i'm not sitting here if you're gonna sit there and creep like that dude you're gonna waste my time and i'm not waiting on you if you want to sit there and clock crawl you can do it but i'm not going to sit there and wait for you to pass me um but we are headed to kansas city and uh i don't know um if we'll be at 3,000 subscribers when this video goes up we've been averaging pretty good numbers for subscribers every day so i just really want to say thank you for that and if you guys have been watching the channel for a little bit but haven't clicked that subscribe button yet please do so we are so close to 3,000. um Today's a Tuesday, but I think I'm gonna wait to upload these yesterday's video um, and today's video, uh, which obviously, I mean, doesn't really matter because when you see it, you see it, I guess. But I'm gonna wait till the weekend to upload them just because I know they'll, you know, more people will be on YouTube and more people will see the video and it doesn't, it's not like I have any other content lined up. Maybe I'll do like a Popeye's chicken food review since like everybody knows I love Popeye's and just like do that. Get something for when I'm on home time, you know? But uh, the thing that sucks is uh, I know in Iowa last night, I had a couple friends send me Snapchats, which everyone does it. I, it's annoying, but as soon as it snows, they're like, it's about to be Christmas. I'm like, dude, everyone can see snow, which I can't. So I do kind of appreciate it now. But before, like when I lived in Iowa, I would like see that and be like, are you freaking kidding me, dude? Are you serious right now? Like I can just look out my car window and see this. But uh, yeah, I'm excited to get back. Um, it's currently 7.45 AM. I wanted to wake up earlier, but I stayed up editing that video last night, um, which I don't know why, but I did. Uh, probably because I just wanted all this space on this GoPro so I could see. I'm really hoping the roads aren't going to get bad closer to Kansas City. I hope they just kind of stay like this where they're a little damp. But I just want to really say thank you guys so much. Like, it has been such a pleasant experience other than a couple of the haters. But to grow the channel within a year from zero to where we're at now i don't even know what number we're at i'm hoping it's 3,000 when you guys see this but i just want to say thank you so much because really i have tried many channels before right like i've tried a gaming channel i've tried just like reality and talk and like nothing worked okay and youtube is a very hard platform to grow um on you know like it's not easy like those big guys, they grinded so hard, you know, like they did it for them. And I, that's impressive to me that they could even grow to a hundred million subscribers. I know this will never do that no matter how much I upload, unless I figure out a way to like mix up content. But like, I never even thought like my gaming channel that I had, had 250 subscribers on it. And I'd been uploading for two years, dude. And I just gave up. I was like, this is never gonna work. Like, it's time to give it up. And here we are now, where we started this channel in May, guys. Like, I don't wanna ramble too much about it, but May to November, 3,000 people of you are all loving my content. And to me, that's just so awesome because I love making the content you know that's how I do it every day if I didn't enjoy this I can upload every day and granted I can't upload every day because some days you know the wheels aren't moving on the truck but when they're moving I'm recording you know so anyways I don't know what else we're gonna really talk about today um, we're probably gonna just drive all this straight this morning so anyways it's been riding with Jay. Peace! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I did that yesterday on accident. <laughs> we're almost, uh, well, we're in St. Louis. Um, it's almost 11 a.m. Uh, there's a Love's, like, just a little bit out of St. Louis. Uh, probably stop there. And I think they have an Arby's, so I'll probably get that rib sandwich, dude. Because that rib sandwich is so underrated. Like, it's so good. Um, but we got 235 miles left, which is about three and a half hours. So we make it to the Kansas City yard 
and then we will be on home time finally we're out of the construction speed speed up a little bit here um, but yeah I'm, I'm excited to go back I need to get an oil change I've needed to get an oil change for a while now uh, so that's like the first thing I'm gonna do when I get back is go get an oil change in my car because uh, it's full synthetic oil but uh, normally it's about you know like five to seven thousand miles you want to change it and I think I'm right around like 5,500 miles so it's time to get an oil change and it's just so expensive for full, full synthetic but you know you got to do it so especially with a car like that just a sweet little car you know sweet little ride but yeah we got you know three and a half hours left um hopefully these three and a half hours go by fast i wasn't gonna stop originally but i figured i might as well just stop there's no reason to just push 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 you know let's get a bite to eat and uh continue on i'm not really sure what happened here other than we had a really bad accident you can see one of the trailer axles snapped off there. Oh my God. Hopefully that driver's okay, man. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. You guys think that driver made it through that or not? Westbound, you guys think that driver made it through that or not? He's taking a hell of a lot of risk. He's just killing the driver. It may have hurt him pretty bad. Uh, if that's going on fatality. Damn, that. I don't know. Yeah, he's definitely, like the driver said, he's probably hurt pretty bad. Um, I don't know if you guys could see it, but that steering column was like all the way up in the dash and this there's like it was the CSI, the state paper, so it was sure. yeah i just hopefully that driver made it out but i i don't know you guys could see that thing was pretty crushed so uh man i just <laughs> like semis are big dude but they you know like semi on semi is not not good like that was very bad so hopefully that driver recovers if he lived through that and you know it's just very frightening to see that kind of stuff all right guys we're getting ready here to go to this loves um let me see which way this truck's going is he getting on the interstate okay yeah he is get us some Arby's hopefully they have the rib sandwich but who knows you know you just never know um yeah that accident was so bad though um what I don't know I like this Garmin GPS I really do Trucker Path used to speak to me but I had it muted because I got tired of like every time you would literally go one mile an hour over the speed limit it'd start beeping and it's connected through my stereo, so it was like super loud in my ear. I do remember uh, the first time I ever stopped as this loves was we were going on vacation. Me and my ex-girlfriend, we were going to Nashville and we stopped here. And it was like we drove from here, Iowa here straight and that was quite a stretch, but I don't think it'd be that quite a... I mean, like, okay. It was quite a stretch only for the fact that my car does not have as much room as this semi dude like this semi there's so much room in these things like it's in, it's unreal how much room there is here are those two cfis parked side by side because if it is i'll park next to them otherwise i'll just take one of these over here be pretty cool to have three semis side by side or cfis side by side i can't tell dude can't tell. I think it is. I'll take the other one once this Pam gets around. Hey, whoever that CFI driver is though, props to that guy. Park it in right here. It's a lot 
gonna see a fight here, dude. It's kind of crazy. All right, well, we're gonna go in. Ooh, that sounded weird. I don't know if it's because it's cold or what, but we're gonna go in and get some food and then uh, continue on. We got 190 miles, so that's like three hours, and then we're done driving. Every time I, uh, hey Garmin, stop navigation. Okay, you canceled. Every time I come here, there's like less and less vehicles here, dude, and it kind of makes me sad, like, but you know, this is where I picked up my blue truck, you know, it was, this place was busy, it was popping. I picked up my blue truck from here, you know, and uh, we had to wait a little bit to get in the gate because there's a Heartland Express driver here, but he didn't know what button he was supposed to push on the thing and he kept pushing the wrong one, so I helped him and we got it all figured out. So uh, we're gonna drop this trailer over here um, and then we're going home, guys. Uh, been out here for a while now. I'm gonna take No, we're not taking that. I'm gonna try to take this one right here. I don't really know. We'll just wait till. need to scooch it over just a little bit here. There we go. Ew. A huge puddle right there, dude. All right, right there, our landing gear is on top of the uh, thing. I think that guy's waiting on me, dude. It's a wet mess here. in a huge freaking puddle, dude. I'm trying to not get the inside of my truck too dirty. All right. I'm gonna let it drop there. and that's his trailer. Hopefully he can drop it down. We gotta finish up our uh, thing here though. And then we'll be able to head out. In our car, I bet my car doesn't even wanna run, dude. So he wanted to know where he was supposed to drop his loaded trailer. And so I just told him, you know, 
empties are on one side and loaded are on the other. So, um, anyways, that's pretty much gonna do it, guys. Um, like I said yesterday, I'll be about a week. Well, it won't be quite a week after you see this video. Kind of cut this up late. Won't be quite a week, a week, um, but it will be sometime. Um, cause this video will come out Sunday just cause I want to space out my videos. I guess there's some lines right there. It's kind of hard to see them, but. All right there. All right, we need to do this. Um, make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe for future content. We'll see you guys in a couple days. Peace. Come on. Everything is a okay when you're riding with Jay. Keep those wheels turning and we do this every day. Backing up a trailer, look at all the roads I've driven. Come and ride with me. Yeah, let me show you how I'm living. Come on.